So Follow Me is a movie about a self-involved YouTuber who kind of reminds me of a few people on the platform, but I won't name names. Anyway, so this vlogger and his friends go around trying to get the most insane footage that they can find and his friend hooks him up with this um, other friend of his who has this escape room in Russia and it's just supposed to be really crazy. So him and his friends fly out to Russia to do this escape room and things go badly. So this movie has some really strong escape rooms, escape rooms or hostel vibes and I really enjoy all those movies so I was excited for this. I thought it had a lot of potential and unfortunately it didn't meet that potential. I feel like all the movies are doing this to me lately, they just keep letting me down. I saw this one movie, The Vigil, The Vigil, yeah that's it, Vigil, um, and it was so bad I actually had to walk out of the movie. I don't know if that's just me or I don't know, I just feel like I'm on a really bad streak with movies lately. I need something good. <laughs> anyway, so follow me. Look, it's entertaining. I wouldn't say it's horrible. It is definitely an entertaining date night, Friday night movie to watch. As for the acting, it's pretty okay, you know, it's nothing special. Cinematography, it's it's alright. We've got some pretty cool shots of Russia. Um, one thing I really did get bothered by is his friends in this movie. Like his friends just just did him dirty. You know, when you watch this movie until the end, you will find out what I mean by that. I don't want to spoil it, but his friends were well with friends what friends like those who needs enemies, let's just say that. So one thing about this movie that found I found really frustrating is the fact that it didn't have Russian caps. It should have had subtitles because so much of this movie was in Russian and you just you were pulled out of it constantly because you couldn't understand what they were saying and it was just really frustrating. Um, and there's one scene in the movie where things are getting serious and he has an opportunity to escape but he doesn't. And when you watch the movie, you're like, wow, you, you made the wrong decision. You should have just left them when you had the chance. That way they would have been like getting what's coming to them. You know, well, you know what I mean? He just, he really has awful friends. And the end scene of this movie, the very end scene, they're all just standing around filming and I won't go into spoiler territory, I won't say what they were filming, but they were filming him doing this, doing something that could get him in a lot of trouble. And it's like, why didn't anybody stop him? You were just standing there watching him. Like, oh. Anyway, look, I just... I just found this movie to be a disappointment and it had a lot of potential, like I said, it could have been better. It's not horrible, it's a good fun weekend movie to watch if you have nothing else to, wa nothing else to watch, but yeah, don't expect any Oscar worthy performances here. So let me know in the comments down below, did you love it, did you hate it, what did you think of it, and honestly I think I'd give it a 5 out of 10. So please help me out and subscribe.